Okay, the next part we are looking at getting to put into our PC build would be a optical drive. Uh, there's not much to even um, compare on optical drives, which is a good thing, so this video should be fairly short compared to the case video. But you can get external drives or you can get internal drives. The picture you see here is an internal drive. If it goes to 24 hour sale, this is a external DVD drive featured internal, internal, internal. That's media for your drives. Um, for the whole purpose of the desktop we're building, we're just going to get internal drive. It's usually cheaper and faster at the same time. Um, external drives would be good if um, you have a lab, like a netbook that doesn't have a drive and you don't necessarily need a drive, don't use a drive a lot, like I hardly use a drive at all ever um, in my computers, um, so I use um, the um, program Steam for all my video games, so it downloads them from the internet, um, but other than that, that's what I use. I have a Blu-ray drive, uh, actually a Blu-ray burner, um, is that necessary? Uh, ninety-nine percent of people no. Um, I got one because I'm really paranoid about my data, and Blu-ray discs are, I guess, fairly cheap for the capacity. Um, I'm one day gonna buy a whole bunch of them and back up all my data physically on disc. Um, see, you can see right here, fi um, ten fifty gig disc or forty dollars, so it's like a five hundred gig hard drive. Um, that's you can store like anywhere um, for forty dollars like that and probably take a while to burn but it'll be worth having a extra backup of all my data which is why I got that it was only like ten dollars more for the burner if you ever think you want to do that you might as well go through the burner but otherwise it's really not necessary otherwise if you don't even think you're gonna play blu-rays at all on your computer through like media or stuff like that there's no reason to even get one save the money and go get a drive like a um, DVD burner I wouldn't even look at a not DVD burner because you might save one dollar a couple dollars to not get a burner it's just you never know if you're gonna have to burn a CD or DVD um, so I would always look into getting a burner because frankly eighteen dollars is pretty darn cheap for a burner uh, that's Typical price between 17 to 22 ish dollars, depending between shipping costs and this one's 25, but a lot of times it's free shipping, so it'd be like 20. Sometimes it goes on sale for like 18. I mean, all these are good. I mean, it could be hit or miss on some. I think I have a light on Blu ray drive, works fine ever since last November, it's now August. So it works perfectly fine. Uh, it's all down the personal preference. Speeds down the personal preference. Personally, I would go for the cheapest one. As long as it's rated good. All these are rated good. So, I mean, cheapest one's probably the light on drive. Unless you can get free shipping through, like, um, services such as um, Shop Runner, which I have a trial of. So I use that. Which is really convenient. So I could get as low as seventeen dollars for a drive um with free shipping it's, and then you can get combo savings with media or you can get see this one get free shipping so it's seventeen dollars probably like weak shipping but it's still free versus paying five dollars to get it in the same amount of time uh, i think that's all i have to say about your drives the modern interface is SATA, um, serial, serial ATA and drives. Um, old drives, if you even look, look into get IDE drives, I know Newegg sells them still, I think. It might be just in CD, DVD drives. Yeah, IDE, they sell like one. But you shouldn't be even needing one of these for a new computer anyway. IDE is an old interface and SATA replaced IDE and and this is just uh, if your drive died and an older computer instead of building a new computer you can just replace the drive uh, and I think that's all I have to say about 
um, DVD drive or optical drives. Uh, if you have any questions, please comment below. And thanks for watching.